doing well, uh, staying safe with the coronavirus outbreak and staying at home. I wanted to throw out a quick back and biceps uh, exercise routine video. All you need for that is two medium to heavy handheld weights and a mat. So let's get started. Before we start, we are going to just warm up our upper body and really quick. So shoulder rolls to the front. One more here. And then shoulder rolls to the back. One more to the back. Now extend your arms all the way up and then press your palms to the back wall or the window. Extend all the way up, press your palms back. Extend all the way up, press your palms back. One more time. I've been enjoying the spring weather. I hope you guys are enjoying it too. Now from here, you're going to give me a big inhale here. Inhale, lift tall. Exhale, sink down, chin to your chest round, your neck round, your back. One more time, inhale, lift all the way up. And as you exhale, sink down, chin to your chest, round your neck, round your back. And slowly lift up. Now let's grab our weights, make sure you're safe while grabbing the weights. Knees bent and back long. We are going to start with the bicep curls. The, that is our first exercise of the routine. Keep your elbows locked into your ribs. 40 seconds, start now. Curl and extend. Curl, extend. Really squeeze your biceps as you come all the way up on top. A little pause at the top and then slowly drop down. Curl up, drop down. Curl up, drop down. Keep on going here. Press and drop. Press, drop. Beautiful and drop. Beautiful work. Keep on breathing. Let me profile it. Keep your shoulders over your hips. Knees have a slight bend in them, so soft knees. Never lock your knees. Give me one more, and then slowly drop it. Our next exercise is bent over row. So come into a half bend lift. Keep your weights close to your legs and knees. You're going to pull your weights into your navel. Push your elbows up to the ceiling. So and then release. So push your elbows back, scap all come together, and then release. Knees to navel here. So bring your weights all the way up. Keep your weights close to your legs, almost like you're dragging them along here. Keep your arms close to your body as well. Brushing your biceps against your ribs each and every time. Press and then release. Press, release. Beautiful here. Keep on squeezing that those scapula back towards each other, towards the spine. Ten seconds. Let's speed it up. Five seconds. Give me three, two, one, and then slowly lift up. Now, soft man curls. We are going to curl all the way up inward our grip and then drop down curl up with the palms facing up invert the grip knuckles facing up and drop down curl up and drop down now you're engaging your forearms as well as your biceps so you're working your muscles that work around the wrists as well remember to keep your Weight centered over here. Beautiful. Try to bring both the arms together. Beautiful. It's okay to go a little slow here. Wonderful work. You will be able to feel this in your forearm muscles. And this is really good for people with tennis elbow 
or wrist issues, this is a good rehab exercise. You want to go a little lighter if you have those issues uh, with your weight factor. Drop down, lift up, drop down. Beautiful. 15 seconds here. Let's speed it up if we can. Make sure your core is still braced and your shoulders are falling over your hips the whole time. Beautiful. Five seconds. Give me one more here. And slowly drop it. We are going to go into a uh, bicep row. So you're going to come down into a half head lift. This time the weights are uh, uh, in line with your shoulders. So farther away from your knees, you're going to pull your elbows all the way up. The weight comes under your chest and then release. Press, release. Press, release, there you go. Beautiful. So once again, you're bringing your shoulder blades in towards each other or pulling them in towards the spine. Spine stays nice and long, so the back is long. No extra arch in the back. And pull your scapula in towards each other. You got three, two, one. And slowly drop it. Now we're going to take it down to our mat. Drop your knees down with a squat and come down to hold a crunch here. So you're going to hold the weights by your side here and hold a crunch. Feet are planted on the mat. Go into a half crunch. Elbows locked into your ribs. Bicep curl and extend. Curl. Extend, curl, extend, beautiful. Press and extend, press, extend. You got 20 seconds here. Now, make sure that your spine stays long and your head stays aligned over your spine. If you start feeling like your back is giving in, you're going to come up taller and that's okay. You can work with your biceps over here as well. Just don't compromise your back. Hold your belly strong though. You will feel those shakes and quakes going on in your core if you hold the crunch. You got two, one, and drop down. Now, drop the weights down here. We're going to go into a plank to a row. So the weights are under your shoulders, feet are hip distance are a little wider for stability. You're going to pull your elbow, right elbow up, drop it down, left elbow up, drop it down. Make sure that your hips stay balanced here and square. So the more stable your torso is, the better the exercise goes. You can also drop down on your knees. Press, drop, press, drop, press, drop. So you always have the option to go down on your knees. Just make sure your back stays nice and long. Hips in line or a little under your shoulders. Press, you got five. Give me one more on each side. Let's go an extra mile and slowly drop it down. Okay, come on up and we are going to go into the second round. Bicep curls. You're going to go curl, extend, curl, extend. Just slow here. Find the control. Beautiful. Knees soft. Toes facing forward. Wonderful job. Press up. Press up. You got 
Let's speed it up. Five seconds. Extend your arms all the way. Two and one. Okay. We are going to go into bent over rows. Knuckles facing me or the mirror. You're going to drop down into a half bed lift. Back is nice and long. Pull your weights into your belly button here. So knee to navel. Close your scapula in towards each other. Head and line over your spine. Chin away from your chest. You can keep your gaze facing forward. I just want to look at the camera to make sure that you are not messing up. Keep on going. Got 20 seconds. Press. Press. Beautiful. Just keeping a stable base here with your feet for four, three, two, one, and slowly lift up. I hope you guys are enjoying the weather outside. It's such a nice spring weather. Make sure that you guys stay active while you're at home. Go for a nice walk. Okay, zot and curls. Curl up. Invert the grip and drop down. Curl up. Invert the grip. Drop down. If you want to take it slow, take it slow. You have any wrist issues, you can drop the weight factor here. Go lighter. This is a good rehab exercise for all the muscles that go in your forearm. So press up and drop down. Press up. Drop down, it really builds your forearms strong, not only your biceps. So press up and drop down. Option to shorten your range of motion. I am fine with that. Okay, you got five more to go here. Five. Four, three, two, beautiful, last one, drop down, and from here we are going to go into the bicep row, second round, you're going to have your weights under your shoulders, drop down into a half bend lift. Hold your elbows to the back, bring the weights under your chest, and squeeze your shoulder blades into each other. Make sure you lift them up top each and every time. Back is nice and long, head aligned with your spine. You've got 30 seconds here. Keep on going. Try to maintain a one count tempo here. So going a little faster than the last time, getting a few more reps in. You can do this, it's going to increase your heart rate too, and that's a good thing. A little sweat is going to do you good. Press up and release, press up, release, make sure the weight come under your chest here. So stay a little higher with your weights because you're engaging your bicep muscles. Five seconds. You got three, two, one more, and slowly lift up. You're going to drop your weights down with the squat. Come down on the mat for a crunch. Now, feet are hip distance, knees are hip distance. Keep your feet planted into the mat and bring your weights here. Elbows locked in by your ribs. Hold the weights into a half curl and press back. See how far back can you go safely and stay there. Now curl all the way, extend down. Just give an inch in between the weights and the ground or the mat. Drop down. Now, any lower back issues, stay a little higher. I'm fine with that. Even a small crunch would do or no crunch would do. 
Just keep your back safe. I don't want your back to be compromised. Lift up. You should be able to feel those core muscles working here as well. Press up. 20 seconds. No, sorry, I misspoke. 10 seconds here. Curl, release, curl, release. Five, four, three, two, one, and drop down. Okay, so drop the weights. Let's flip around. Hands under your shoulders. You can be on your knees for a plank or on your toes. You're going to plank, going to go into plank to row. So lift, drag, elbow up. You will feel the scapula pulling into your spine. Right elbow up to the ceiling, drop down. Left elbow up, drop down. Lift and drop, lift and drop. Press, drop, press, drop, press, drop, press. Drop, you got two and two. Keep your torso stable and drop it down. Awesome work, guys. Let's go into a quick child's pose here to stretch out. Pull your toes together. Send your seat back to your heels and extend your arms. Drop your head in between your biceps. You can the crown of your head or your forehead down. Just let your back relax. Drop your shoulders down. Big deep breaths in and out. And then slowly rise up. We're going to stretch our biceps quick. Extend your arms towards me and press your fingertips towards you with your other hand. Switch sides. Beautiful. Now reach with one arm to the opposite side. Release. Same thing, other side. Release. Bring your fingertips towards you and press your palms towards me. Lift your palms up and slowly release it. Two big closing breaths here. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, sink down. One more time. Inhale, lift tall. Hands in prayer, heart center. May there be strength in your bodies, happiness in your heart, peace in your souls. Stay healthy, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.